In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a strip on your Wix website. In this video, I'm simply going to show you step by step how you can do it. So even though you've never done this before or don't even know where to find it, I'm going to show you how you can do it. Now, let's not waste any time and let's just get started. So what you want to do is simply go into your Wix website. So this is just a website that I'm going to use for the video. Now you want to go into the Wix website editor, of course, um, which looks like this. If you don't know how you can get here, simply go to your My Sites page or to the dashboard. And then you can simply click on one of the sites, click select and edit site, and then click edit. And you'll then end up right there. But I'm pretty sure you guys know that. Now, once you're here, what you can do is click on the add button on the left hand side and then kind of like instantly you already end up on the strip uh, section or like strip page as you can see it clearly says strip right away and then it says add a strip so there are a couple of them that you can use we've got about we've got contacts we've got welcome strips services teams testimonials and classic so this really depends on what you would like to add on your website let's say that you want to add a about section you simply click on this and it will then um, show up right there so you can add it simply by doing that it's really basic what you can now do is simply customize it so click manage or change whatever uh, whatever option you would like to go with you can then pick a column and you can then pick an action so you can like move these around switch them and that's pretty much how you can change it now of course editing uh, editing the text is really basic simply click edit text right there and that is it now that is pretty much how you can add a strip so once again go to wix click add strip choose the one that you would like to add you can do service welcome contact team whatever click on it and it will show up pretty basic and you can then start customizing that um, so yeah, that, that is pretty much how you can do it. If this video helps you out, make sure you go ahead and leave a like on the video. I would appreciate that. Let me know if you have any questions and then I'll see you next time. Have a good day.